so we saw this new world in the last episode. Why don't we go there next? The we maze? The maze? Yeah. We're going to the maze already? No, no, not the maze. Oh. Remember where I got the shield? In a cave? Yeah. Is that it's cave part of the Coming country area place thingy. Oh yeah, the world of that uh, stupid dragon thing. Yeah. Uh, that thing just popped up out of a tree. <laughs> uh, he popped into the pond from the tree. Oh, the thing joy is the water on that class, so he just appeared on top of it. Well, now we have one more unit of health to uh get shoved out of us as soon as we get into a corner with a bunch of monsters. Exactly. Hey. Okay, I could kind of see the crack. But it's still barely noticeable. The Book of Hyrule! At last it has been found! But it seems to have a... Cur lock on it! We must find the key to open it! <laughs> I have a couple questions. I have a key right now. Why exactly is this... Oh, wait, you're, oh, you're on the table. I know. Oh, <laughs> anyways, how did... Anyways, how did this guy survive being trapped in a cave for so long? He... I didn't know. Because there were there's that it's a one room cave and it was completely shut and there were somehow lanterns in there. Oh, Ruby. And this guy just waited for someone to walk in to say his thick piece. Hopefully, okay, I wasn't talking, so I'll probably cut that out. But my ringtone is Ruby, and I just heard Ruby. Mm. Uh, nope. It we must be right. on the low volume. To the shallow forest. I love how the music is your only indication that it's changed. Also, red rupees are worth ten. At least it's good music. We're warping without using books. Yeah, we just locked into a new world. How do you know it's a new world? Because the background music is different, obviously. Okay, how does Link know it's a new world? Because oh, and up. it's cutting Candyland. Oh yeah, we don't have our map anymore. <laughs> Welcome to Shallow Forest. Is that a hundred and sixty? Yeah, I just rupees. looked down there. <laughs> That's a that lot of a, rupees. <laughs> that is a hundred <laughs> rupees, but we need the ladder to get to it. Oh. <laughs> So close, yep, that's yet a so far. I've ever seen one. Hello, n hello, fairy. Yep. <laughs> hello, Navi. Navi. Oh God. Navi. I call her Navi. I don't Why is her? If, if I'm saying her name right. I call so her Navi too. All right, now we have the map. I always call her call her Navi because of the word navigator. And it's not like they're using Japanese, otherwise Navi would be correct. They could. It could be. Well, Japanese. I don't know. Or it could be. I don't know. Because it would be the proper well, we amount of syllables if it were. Yep. So I love how the the shallow forest is just a, a, a pipe. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. We should just call Digi and. Or Di Well, Digi. You know what you should do? You should, I you was need to make just a thinking of that. A landscaping <laughs> service or something. Did we need to get Digi over to him? Or <laughs> it'll pay. Him, it'll pay for itself. Hey, do the boomerangs cut the grass? <laughs> did they no, do okay, that in Zelda mind. One? I know they did that in Link to the Past. I think Link to the Past. Yeah, I just realized something. Wait, why is there a forest inside a dungeon? Be uh, Shut up! Well, game, game logic. You can be creative in this. I don't know. <laughs> because, it's because why not? Goria's dead, by the way. But yes, we need the candle to yeah, you get you here. You have. Oh, I thought you said we need the candle to continue, so that's why we came in here. Hello. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 
Oh. And then Wild Master is unkillable. Oh. oh. They got a buff in this game. Yeah, anyways, I was about to say something this earlier, but... If... It, um, imagine cutting all this grass in Pokemon. You have to pause. Yeah, anyways, I was about to say something this earlier, but... If it, um, yeah, imagine cutting all this grass in Pokemon. You have to pause, go to the menu, <laughs> hit cut, and you end up only cutting like yeah. four tiles of grass. Speaking of that, I hit Pokemon Gen One. You had to go into your menu, scroll over to Pokemon. I'm just saying, like, in order tiles. to use anything, there was no like. Just this imagine can be moved that. with strength. Do you want to use strength on Boulder? Yes or no. It was go to Hitmon Chan. Use bol uh, use strength. Now we can push Boulder. Speaking of which, did you choose Hitmonchan? Uh, yeah. Because... Did you know? Yeah. Did you know you just got gypped? How? Hitmonchan sucks in Gen One. Okay. Well, I used him as an HM slave, so there you go. Oh goody. Yeah. The problem with Hitmonchan is the moves he learns, like Thunder Punch, Fire Punch, Ice Punch. Great oh moves, yeah. Right? Because they're not physical in Gen 1 because of their typing. Yeah. It took him to Gen 4 to fix that. I mean, he did get Mach Punch in Gen 2, but that doesn't really mean much when his best moves are still special. Yeah, Hitmonlee is definitely better in Gen 1. I had a Mew that, that knew Mega Punch and Mega Kick. I have, a, I have a screenshot of Cerebi saying Mega Punch was a 95 power water type move. Hi, Goma. <laughs> Hi, Goma. What are you doing here? Oh, guarding, guarding key. key. Could you, in theory, just walk past him and stay healthy by staying at the fountain? Uh, no. If you want to kill him. Is that a fairy fountain? If you want to kill him, no. But in theory, yes, you could do that. I didn't know the fountain heals you. Yeah. No, personally, oh, yes. I hated this dungeon. Well, the rest of the game is fine. The, the, the candle uses up magic, and there's no real way of recovering magic in this dungeon. So you're basically avoiding use of the candle as much as possible. Why? You should, you should just avoid these things at all costs rather than killing them. I actually had to kill him to open that door. Oh, you did? Yep. I don't go through the door until later, but... Yeah. You know, I really hate doors that just stay locked if you don't kill the enemies. <laughs> so I was quiet because my dog started to bark and I can cut that shit out. Oh great, Dark Nuts! My favorite enemy. Along with bubbles. Along with okay, the bubbles. Okay, so what's your justification oh, hey, of, getting... uh, of killing these things? Uh... Don't they have a right to death? <laughs> They're trying to murder me! <laughs> <laughs> well, these Dark Nuts don't have shields, so... Their right to life has been revoked the moment they try <laughs> to murder me. Okay, that bubble is... Really fucking well, to be fair, it doesn't hurt you. Yeah, to be fair, that bubble did save her life because you, because um, it pushed you through the enemy. Why are you even fair? Why are you even fighting these things? Yeah, the door's open. Do oh wait, you probably get like an item or something. Remember, this that <laughs> bubble is trolling the shit out of you. This was back in December. I don't know why I did the things that I did. I'd like to know why that bubble is going in random directions instead of going around somewhere. Alright, the Dark Nut's dead. All you, he's, it's going on a path towards him. The bubbles actually act randomly. Can't, can't you kill a bubble with a boomerang? No, not in this imagine game. If that imagine if the bubble okay. actually did hurt you with how it keeps coming after you like that. Oh, I would <laughs> fucking never play this game. Yeah, you got that right. I wouldn't play it either. How, can you kill the bubble? Nope. I'd like to know why that bubble um, has a skull on it. Is it is it like the spo is it like the SpongeBob dirty bubbles evil cousin or something? <laughs> something like that. Yeah. 
Okay, so why is it going slow right, now? Get oh. it. There's nothing in here. Leave. Oh, there's a pal. Oh. Why, why didn't you just <laughs> You do really that? want that one rupee? Why is it going so slow compared to before? Because if it sees you, it I'm goes... fairly certain it has seen Digi on more than one occasion during that trip in the room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great. I need magic. Hey, guess what you don't have? Guess why I hate this place. Time to farm. Magic doesn't Better appear in, in bushes, so yay. Better get your hoe and your seeds and start farming. <laughs> Oh, you'll be seeing a farm later. Lovely. <laughs> well, there's magic that you may or may not get if you don't hurry. Stupid lag light. Can it take your new shield? Yes. Away? Oh, that blows. Stupid lag light. I don't know, I kind of like it. <laughs> what the fuck?! <laughs> Ah. Shit. Are you supposed to know that that key was there? I sure did. The trees, see. they hide things. Through the power of trial and error. Oh goody. I have magic. There's a bush. <sighs> burn the bush. I love, I love how you have to have magic in order to burn a bush. Normally the candle doesn't cost you anything. All it does is show you, hey, dumbass, this way. Okay. <laughs> Just like um, Dragon Wait, Ball Z, why? I just see it go through you. That, hold on, hold on, that just took you in a circle. <laughs> yep. What? And I took advantage of it. <laughs> Wait. What was the point? Um, getting over here? You could have backtracked. No, the door closed on you when you entered that room. Oh yeah. I don't know about you, but I would. But once I started getting hit, I would have just said screw everything and go straight for the map and hope I got it before it died. So. Uh, it's kind of what I did. Sigoria's den is a wing, by the way. I love how it closes that. <laughs> 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 Digi just came past Digi just came back in his <laughs> contemplating life right now. This is so dumb. And you have to have magic again! Yeah. <laughs> you yeah. fucking cut! Wait, did you just jump cut? Yes. He jump cut. Because shenanigans and, and shit. Because there's a fairy fountain outside if you uh if you run out of magic. You know what this music reminds me of? Have you guys ever played Drekken for the SNES? <laughs> Drekken for the SNES. I've never owned a Snuff. Uh, so. no. It's, it is literally the worst RPG in the fucking world. You can't even control your characters when you fight. Anyways, the music sounds a lot like the music uh, when you're traveling. And that's not a good thing because the music in that game puts me to sleep. So the music I'm hearing right now is putting me to sleep. There's something here. Okay, yeah, <laughs> map says there's something here. Something you can't get! Cause I don't have a ladder. Suck a dick, bitch! Which means that you have to exit the dungeon. With, and since you don't have magic, you need a world well, to get unless out. The dungeon might, unless the dungeon item in this game... Leave the room. Leave the room. Leave the, yes, yes, yes. No, yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I like how you stopped at the doorway. Thought, should I go back and kill them? Just leave the room. <laughs> Unless the dungeon item in this uh, in this dungeon is is the ladder. Nope. I mean, oh, it could be. Better go out for the fairy to get one heart. That yeah, room is really good for picking stuff up. Yeah. I, boomerang, in my opinion, is the best stuff I, I have a question. Exactly why are the snakes called ropes? Um, because Nintendo said so. It's actually a uh, joke they made back in the what? 
cartoon series. Yeah, yeah, and why are uh, the bats called keys? Because I don't mind so. keys, that but rope. Here. You can actually... So either take away one heart permanently or take away 50 rupees. You can die or give me money. <laughs> Why is this choice a thing? <laughs> it's like in the original Zelda. If you can take a potion or a heart container, which one do you want? Oh, there's some rooms that completely block off the money option. Well, we are stopping in the middle of the dungeon. Because Digi just died, so we will see you next time. Yep. I thought.